The Gion Festival started during a time of plagues. Uh, Kyoto has a rainy season every summer for a month. And so in ancient time, well, not that ancient, up until the mid 1900s, they would have standing water and all the different kinds of diseases that are associated with that, things like dysentery and cholera and, and so on, um, hygiene related illnesses. But more than a thousand years ago, probably much more recently than that, people thought that these illnesses were caused by spirits who were angry at us. And so it started as a, a prayer to the spirits to try to get them on our side, so to speak. And one of the reasons I find this so interesting is, so there's in Japanese, there's something that's called vengeful spirits. Those are called onryo. <clears throat> And they can be converted into benevolent spirits who then help you and, and make your life better. And those are called godio. And what's so interesting about this is that when I was living in the Brazilian Amazon, they basically had the same belief system, that every person was host, I guess we could say, to some troublesome spirits. However, by our good actions, and our faith and our leading a good life, we could convert them and they would become benevolent, helpful spirits and make our life better. And I just find that so fascinating. Basically, it's modern psychology, right, where we take our shadow that's causing us all kinds of trouble and we explore it and there's strengths hidden in there that, that we can free up and develop. And I just find it so fascinating, these different ways of, of looking at that.